Hi guys, John Furrier with Acceleration Sports. Today we're going to go over a specific movement that's correlated to shot strength. We get a lot of questions about how shot, uh, shot strength for soccer can improve and what exercises we can do to improve that. So the exercise we're going to go over today is what we call uh, front foot elevated split squat. Um, in our training practice we find that that specific exercise correlates really well to soccer players improving their shot strength. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a, a quick execution of that movement. Um, and then what we're going to do is we're going to write a little article about that, put it in our newsletter so you guys can get a little idea on how that can help. Okay, real basically what you're going to do is you're going to find about a four to six inch box. Okay, you're going to put your foot up on the box. So today we're going to use right foot. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually put the right foot on the box and we're going to turn the foot out on a little bit of an angle. So if you had a clock, the right foot's going to face about one o'clock on the clock. Okay, hands on the hips. Okay, back foot is gonna go back. Now, what, one of the mistakes I see a lot of people make is they actually put their foot directly behind, and what happens is they lose their balance. You wanna put your back foot behind for stability so it separates, okay, so you're on a little bit of an angle here. You're gonna get up on your back toe, okay, so it's front foot on the box, toe turning toward about one o'clock on the clock. What you're gonna do is you're gonna slowly descend. Okay, you're gonna go down nice and low so the calf it's the hamstring, and then come back up. Now what I'd like to see you guys do is you can try this on your own. You're gonna start with just body weight. Now everybody has different flexibility levels, okay? My flexibility level, as a, please forgive me, is not great at my age. So one of the things I wanna do is really make it clear to everybody is that you really wanna uh, establish your flexibility. So your back leg should actually be very, very straight while the front knee bends. So yeah, as you can see, as my back leg bends a little bit, my, my front leg, my, my back leg wants to bend down a little bit. So if you can keep that back leg as straight as possible while keeping the front knee bent, that's really gonna benefit you a lot. You're gonna feel the exercise in the front of your thigh, okay? Mainly in the, uh, the vastus medialis muscle, which is right in the, in the side of the thigh over here. So exercise we just showed you is what we call front foot elevated split squat. Do that exercise, you can do it maybe a couple times a week. Just find a four to six inch box, you can do it at home. Figure about three sets. Keep your rep range anywhere between, say, 6 and 12 reps, and I think that'll work really well for you. Everybody have a good day, and we'll see you next time.